Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, me again. Uh, 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 Iowa Interstate 96 here. Uh, I got a little channel changed. My I won't call my channel Iowa Interstate 96. But here we have some garage door openers. I haven't done a video of a garage door opener. We have two garage door openers today. They are Axis Master garage door openers. Now maybe they look like the 1260 LM. If you guys know what these door openers are, can you please maybe let me know. These look like um, LiftMaster 1260 LMs, 1265s, because they're pretty high up, so I can't really climb a ladder to see the model number. So uh, here's the garage doors. Uh, oh, and also this garage door had, had a little update in April. Uh, it had a brand new torsion spring. Well, actually, this spring broke about the same time as always. If you want to check out my channel, I still got the video of the broken spring. It was a really old spring. It was made a lot of noise and finally snapped. Uh, so these are Axis Master garage door openers. And then over here, we have the wall control. Right here is the wall control right there. That's just a button wall control and also I want to show you maybe the remotes you may have to get in one of the cars my this is my aunt's uh, Toyota Avalon 06 and then a 94 LS LS um, 400 I got a video on this on my channel this cars on my channel so they look like they're gonna be locked which oh this one's not this is a, this is an Avalon so pardon me about the cars so uh, the clicker must be oh, there's the clicker Here's the clicker right here. Uh, it looks like a, a LiftMaster, looks like a 978 LM, but it's not the 978 LM. And these are all built by Chamberlain anyway, basically, because the buttons look like Chamberlain. Uh, here's the three button one. Now, this one was in the little garage, so I'm guessing the little garage for big buttons for the little garage, so, and then this button right here is for the big door. So, um, this is manufactured in 99. 05 or 99. This is a 973 AC uh, garage remote. Uh, it's an Axis Master. It's basically AC stands for Axis Master. You can see right there. So it looks really nice. I just love these remotes. I also maybe have a garage door update. I may get a own garage door remote for myself for my garage door. But uh, we are going to run the doors today. We are going to run the big door first. And I believe it's this third button because... Uh, this door must be programmed to that one, and this one's programmed to this one. So we'll try it. So either door. So let's just back up. I don't know really. Remember which door it was. So here we go. Oh, maybe not. Hold on. Maybe it's just this door. We'll run this door up, okay? Very nice. Has metal rollers. All doors still on the sound like that, which is annoying. But I can't really see any metal rollers. This is the garage door opener. We'll do an outside view of the garage door. Here we go. Runs great. Those metal rollers. Very nice. Run this back up. This is a clope door, I believe. These doors. Uh, let me see. Indial doors. I think that's clope. I'm not sure. Okay, run this down and we'll run the big door. Very nice, runs great. Now, hold on. Thought this was program. Maybe it was the other remote. Oh, well, we may not go do an outside view on it. This must be not programmed to it. It's not programmed to it. All right. Well, this is the 973 AC. So we'll run the big door with the wall control. I don't know why I thought it was programmed to it. it looks like it's not. Nothing's happening. Unless it has a weak signal. There it goes, there it goes, got it. 
There we go. I was thinking it was programmed to the big door. There we go. Okay, it has a weak signal. I don't know why. It's programmed to the... Okay, we'll do an outside view. We got it. I think I may have to hold the button. Here we go. There we go. There it goes. It was programmed to it. These are also clopay doors. And also we have the keypad. It looks like a... I think a 976 LM. Uh, let me see. I don't know what it is. I think this is a 96 LM. I'm not sure, guys. Comment on, comment on that. So, yeah. We'll run this back up using the 973 AC remote. We'll just back up. Get a big view. Here we go. One's great. Beautiful remote. I love this remote. This was manufactured in 05 and 99, so this is about 10, 17 years old? Eight, 14 years old. Okay, we're running this down we're using the remote again. Here we go. Let's get a good view on the back. Here we go. Runs great, runs great. Here's the safety sensors. They're uh, Chamberlain. They just look just the same. Man, these are clope doors. That's the lock right there. I don't know if you can see that. There it is right there. These are clope doors. I think this one has... Oh, they have metal rollers. The little one needs non-rollers. I just got a little big grease right there. That's great. Here's the springs on this. This one's been replaced twice on the garage door. This one broke more. Well, it's a bigger door, so uh, this is the garage door stuff. It's a clope door. I believe this is a clope. Let me check if this is a clope. I think it is. It looks like it. But shoot me on a deal on these doors, guys. But I think these are clope. Here's the small door again. Like I said, the spring got replaced a while ago. This April, it got replaced. Let me see here. I'm just trying to figure out if these doors are clopes or not. I think this is a clope. What is this? I have no clue what door these are. Beautiful doors though. Okay, it says in dual door. I don't know if it, I think these are clope doors, guys, but not sure, but kinda hopefully you guys know this. So guys, hopefully you enjoyed the video on my uncle's and ants garage stores. Have a good one.